This next chapter, we're going to be discussing rums. Here we have a silver rum, which is not aged at all, a uh, very clean flavor. Here we've got the gold, aged a little bit longer, gives it notes of caramel. Here's a high proof. If you're going to be very responsible, it's good for lighting on fire uh, and flavored. All right, this next drink we're making is a champagne mojito. I feel like the mojito has become more prominent in the past few years, but uh, I think the addition of champagne kind of makes a fancy drink fancier. I like to begin by measuring out my ice. Let me show you a technique called muddling. I'm going to be adding the juice of two limes, a sprig of mint, five leaves should be good, simple syrup, three count. Hold your glass firmly and just start uh, bruising it downward. Now we add our rum, five count. Let's give it a shake. Back into our serving glass. Fill with champagne. champagne mojito. All right, let's make a cabana boy. We're gonna start off by adding uh, ice to the glass. Do a five count of white rum. Just a splash of sweetened lime juice. You can make this yourself by doing uh, equal parts sugar and water and just adding fresh lime to the mix. Fill with pineapple. We're gonna be garnishing today with slices of cucumber. I'm not gonna be muddling it because I think that would create some unpleasant chunks and it would drown out the aromatic quality that it's gonna bring to the table. I'm gonna float one right on top and it's really gonna enhance your drink. Cabana boy. This next drink we're gonna be making is called a rum shaker. The ingredient list is as follows. High proof rum, sweetened lime juice, grenadine, pineapple juice. Let's begin by decorating the glass. I'm gonna rim it with a cut lime all the way around so the sugar has something to stick to. We're using a pink sugar today. I'll go ahead and fill my glass with ice. The high proof rums come with their own self stopper, so it's gonna be a much longer count. We're gonna do a double, so it'll be a 10 count to get the same amount of alcohol. Add a dash of pineapple, a little grenadine for color, sweet and lime juice. We're gonna give it all a shake and strain it into our glass. Now this is a really strong drink. That's why we're making it as a shot because this is not something you're really gonna want to sip on. You're probably just going to want to take this one and knock it right down. The rum shaker. <laughs>